Alright, this is my recording for the class. I'm playing extra plus ordinary. So let's just begin. Once upon a time, not that long ago, in a land not so far away, a young boy excitedly scurried home from school, ready to share in his extraordinary day with his family. Turning on his heels and quickly entering his family's estate, our hero was shocked to see his family in a tizzy of boxes. His older brother, Mateo, unhappily carried boxes to and fro the family RV, while his mother and father conversed in hushed tones about unknown affairs. Mama? James asked curiously as he tugged on his mother's shirt, unsure of the events unfolding in front of him. What's going on? Why are we packing up the RV? he questioned. I thought we weren't leaving for Grandma and Grandpa's for a few more weeks. Oh, welcome home, Jamie, his mother said, startled slightly by James's sudden appearance and hoping he hadn't heard too much. Uh, well, yes, they... they wanted us to come earlier. Yes, Grandma and Grandpa just missed us oh so much that they invited us to come early. That's why we're packing up so suddenly. They did? James exclaimed, overly excited at the news of their early departure. They did, his mother assured him. And as soon as we get on the RV, we can go. Why don't you go on ahead? Nodding happily, James rushed to the RV and cast aside his things, ready for his next extraordinary adventure. As he looked back upon his beloved childhood home, now growing smaller and smaller in the distance, James's heart bubbled with joy and excitement over this new endeavor. Little did he know his older brother's heart did not. A few short hours later, as the sun hung low in the sky and the day slowly turned to night, our young hero's family RV rolled to a slow stop just at the edge of a local county restroom. Mateo, dear, James's mother called from the driver's seat. Take James to the bathroom, please. We're getting onto the highway here soon and there won't be an opportunity to stop later on. Ugh, fine, whatever, Mateo groaned unhappily and hopped off the RV with James in tandem. Hurry up, punk, before I leave you behind and the spiders eat you. Mateo laughed as he dashed into the bathroom, leaving James far behind. Okay, so they didn't really show the tutorial or anything of what the controls are, but I do know there was a README, so I'll just go off of that. So just WASD to move, left click is to use your sword, right click is to jump. I know there's a flashlight button. Let me just quickly go back through that. Uh, WASD. Scroll wheel. Alright. There we go. Alright, so the f I don't know if it's a bug, but the flashlight just kind of floats off to the side. You're not really holding it. Okay. And then I can't use the other ability, but can't use the paddle ball thing either. Okay. So let's go. So we're just in the starting area right now. Not a lot. Looks like we can go in here. Alright, checkpoint. What's the Okay, he seems to blow bubble wall in the air. It's probably glitch. Oh, we got there. See, he doesn't hold that either. Yeah, we got the flashlight. Alright. Three hearts. Health. Alien. Can I... Oh, yep. He's taking my health down. Okay, so I died from that. Let's try again. Maybe because I was standing in the water. Yeah, no. Alright. Come on, get the scorpion. Alright. I like the use of the 2D and the 3D animation. Alright. Oh, okay, so I gotta go backwards, get the health. Alright. Can I, nope, the dinosaurs cannot die. Oh, floating hearts, see if I can get that. All 
Alright, so I'm already having <laughs> a little bit of trouble. Can you, there we go. Alright, I can't be next to the object to jump. Alright, how am I gonna do this? Okay. So, I found a glitch. Apparently, if you jump up high enough and then you go backwards towards the wall, you get stuck in the wall. Oh, look. And he's got a big bubble. Can I... I am stuck. Is there a... Okay, I gotta restart the game then. That kind of sucks. Where's the original? Alright. So we go back. Skip the intro because I already did that. And we are back. Checkpoint. Alright. Uh, I'm gonna ignore the water because I think that's what happened last time. Yep, yeah, it is the water, not the alien. My bad. Misunderstanding. Come on. Hello, Scorpion. I wonder if. Oh. No, it doesn't show anything. Okay. Oh, do I go in the toilet, maybe? Okay. I can clearly see something in the top right. Maybe I just gotta jump over there. Alright, I'm just gonna skip the heart for now and just see if I can... Get over there! <sighs> Come on. Ooh, that's a big jump. Okay. So I can just triple click and he can just keep jumping up. So we're still in the same area and nothing's really changed so far. Oh, we got spiders. Can I hit them with... Oh, okay. You can kind of hit them with a projectile, I think. Yeah, no. Okay. Okay, so they can go close and far from the screen. Just gonna have to. No, 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 no. Is he? Oh, he's defeated. I guess I gotta jump over this one again so what did the bubble go down. Alright, we're at another checkpoint. We're still kind of in the. Same scenery, but now it's green. Green. And we got a little toilet monster. Can you fight him? Nope. No health either. Alright, so I assume I gotta jump again. Using the jump mechanics, yep. Alright, so there's a key there. Okay, so I got stuck in the wall again. I'm gonna try not to do that to have to restart the game. Another glitch, I'm floating. Get. Oh. Come on. Alright. I got a key. I'm assuming I'm gonna have to use that soon. Can I... Do I have to go forwards? I do. Can I walk across that? Uh, Alright. We are now in the bathroom again. Just seems like so far it's multiple areas. Uh, okay. What the heck? Oh my god, boss battle. Maybe I'm doing 
stuff because I hear him saying that. No, checkpoint, maybe? I just lost a life as far as I'm aware. Do I have to hit the bombs back at him? Somehow. I'm not even losing the health please go off. Is that intended? And just then, as James landed so his final him. blow upon the shattery figure of his brother and bested him fairly in battle, the world turned to a blinding white and Mateo's voice echoed through the bathroom. Just you wait for what comes next. You'll be sorry. Alright, so looks like that was the whole game. There were just a couple enemies, mostly it was just like water scorpion, the spiders, and then the final boss. Uh, it was just really one area, it was just that outside leading towards the inside of the bathroom. Uh, not a whole bunch of elves. Uh, they should have explained the ping pong paddle thing some more though. But that'd be it, let's just go through some of the other stuff and see. Okay, so they do have instructions. I just did the readme instead. So this would have been nice to know playing through the first time. I did mouse and keyboard, I don't have the controller. It's the people that play. So I'll just go back and play it a little more. Skip the story. See if I can try to not get stuck on anything this time. See if I can get that extra heart. I can go up here. Nah, okay. Alright, so it's the same area again. Let's see if I can oh, get him first and do this. Oh my god, I'm stuck in the wall again. Seriously? I'm not gonna get the hell if I'm getting stuck in the wall again. We'll just keep playing. Oop, took a little damage there. Same scene again. Alright, get him. Um, it's cool how the enemies can move between, like, moving forwards and backwards for, like, a sense of depth perception. And just, kind of just that 
No, there's just gonna stay there. Alright, let's at least get the health. Alright, no. Do not get close to that wall at all. Ugh. Go! How did I do it last time? It jumped. Yep. He seems to kind of be stuck on the wall. Why is it with me in the walls? Wow, okay, so you gotta jump up, then go over. Alright, let's try to use the ball some more. Alright, so I hit you. You've changed from forward, so why can't I hit you again? Alright, so you can hit me, but I can Okay. Seems like you can just push the spider and he'll just move across. Screen. Oh, there's the bad guy. No, stop, spider. Uh, all right. I don't know if that's me or they. All right, they move on their own. All right, still can't get them. Let's keep going. All right, I got this now. So, yeah. Same scenery again. Got the little toilet, little green rain, acid rain, whatever you want to call it. So this is where we have to jump up again. Uh, of course I am struggling with the jumping still. Alright. Oh, okay, looks like I was another glitch. I was stuck on the wall again. Just me and the walls. Uh, walls and me in this game just don't mix. Alright. There we go. Uh, they're just purely there for decoration. Okay. Uh, ping pong paddle. Close enough to where I actually see it. Do the damage. Ping pong. I have to be a little further out here. Nope. Come on. Can I do it a different way? Alright. Doesn't really look like it, so let's just. that I already know what I'm kind of doing. I can focus more on the background. That's kind of cool with the uh, mirrors, how they are their enemies as well. I mean, there's the alien and the dinosaurs from earlier. So I guess they're just kind of spectating the final boss battle.
how many more do you hit? Is it these checkpoints? Come on. Checkpoint, I'm guessing I didn't hit him. Come on. at that time. Taking so long compared to the first time. Come on. Okay. So you just launch them the other way. Did not know that. I need more bombs to throw them. Alright, maybe this will make more progress. Come on. Close to the timeline for the video, so I'm just gonna stop it there. But thanks for watching.